The Constitution has three main functions. First, it creates a national government consisting of a legislative, an executive, and a judicial branch, with a system of checks and balances among three branches. Second, it divides power between the federal government and state government. The Constitution provides separation of powers. The legislative branch makes laws. The executive carries out laws, and the judicial evaluates laws. We the people of the United States, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and secure the blessing of liberty to ourselves and our prosperity. Do ordain and establish this Constitution for the United States of America. The First Amendment guarantees freedom of religion, speech, the press, assembly, and petition. The Second Amendment protects the individual rights to keep and bear arms. The Third Amendment places restrictions on the quartering of soldiers in private homes without the owner's consent, forbidding the practice in peacetime. The Fourth Amendment prohibits unreasonable searches and seizures. The Fifth Amendment is an amendment to the Constitution that guarantees U.S. citizens specific rights due process including not having to testify against yourself if you're accused of committing a crime. The Sixth Amendment is a section of the Bill of Rights that guarantees a citizen the right to a speedy trial a fair jury, and an attorney if the accused person wants one, and the chance to confront witnesses who is accusing the defendant of a crime. The Seventh Amendment codifies the right to a jury trial in certain civil cases and inhibits courts from overturning a jury's finding of the facts. The Eighth Amendment of the Constitution states excessive bail shall not be required nor excessive fines imposed, nor cruel and unusual punishment inflicted. The Ninth Amendment says that all the rights not listed in the Constitution belong to the people, not the government. In other words, the rights of the people are not limited to just the rights listed in the Constitution. The Tenth Amendment states that any power not specifically given to the federal government by the Constitution belongs to the states and the people. The National Archives Building is home to more than 3 billion records in total, including the three most important documents in American history, the Declaration of Independence, the United States Constitution, and the Bill of Rights. These can be viewed in the building's rotunda for the Charters of Freedom. <laughs>